Wentz in the shotgun. He's back. He's looking. He fires. And it is complete to Alshon Jeffrey for a touchdown. Joining us for this week's tape study, well, the first time is wide receivers coach Mike Grow. Great to be here. How are you doing, coach? Yep, great. Thanks for joining us. I want to talk about these wide receivers, man. Uh, got a great collection of players here, and they all contribute each week. Let's take a look at some plays here. Let's take a look at Alshon Jeffrey, who's really started to come on here. Against the Dallas Cowboys, want to get a little bit of a two-man on the top, and he got safety help on the top, but Carson Wentz is still able to fit this ball in there. Yeah, one of the things you can't see before the play starts is the safety sitting back here off the hash. And like you said, Ike, it's two-man, so we've got two high safeties over the top, and then we have man coverage underneath. And we stack the receivers here to help them shake free at the line of scrimmage. And they end up locking right here on Alshon. And then the off player, he's got Nelson. So as we roll the tape here, Alshon gets the outside release. This is exactly the look that we had in practice earlier in the week with the two high safety. It's really designed for a one high safety look. But he has the ability to bend it inside the safety to the near side. And Carson sees that immediately. And Alshon does a good job, what we say, just running around the building there. And nice. then obviously a great job by Carson leading him right into that window. Hands catch by Alshon to get into the end zone. That is a tight window to fit that ball in. Great job from Alshon being able to catch that ball. Good right example, too, of the growth between these two guys here over the course of the season and the anticipation and trust that Carson has to lead him right into that window. Yeah, you're really starting to see those two pick up their play. Take a look at a play a little bit earlier in the season. And again, we talk about the uh, variety of guys you got you have to work with at this position. Going to watch Torrey Smith here. Big touchdown for him here as well. I like the route concept here from the whole group. It's a great concept. It's a very versatile concept. It's really designed to beat man coverage, Ike. But you can see right here, Arizona wants to bring a zero pressure look. They've got no deep safeties in Carson. He immediately recognizes that there's no deep safeties. We got one-on-one -on -one coverage back on the back end. And now that's when Torrey, he comes alive in this play. Ordinarily, it would be for the underneath, trying to create some friction there and rubs underneath. But because of the zero deep safety look, Carson recognizes that immediately, and he stands in tall. And you can see the protection that he's got to be able to do that. Tremendous job by the offensive line. Great job. Torrey does a good job here, too, of stepping on the DB's toes. He doesn't cut this thing off early, right, which would allow the DB to make a play on the football. Nice job there, Torrey, understanding that middle of the field is wide open. Absolutely. Good throw from uh, Carson there leading, Torrey. Great catch, great touchdown there against Arizona. And one of the other things that's really unique about that, too, is the ball never goes there in practice right. <laughs> and there's a guy in the game hustling saying I'm the primary receiver and then the ball finds him when we get the coverage look yeah that's a great understanding knowing the ball can come to you at any time especially with Carson yeah time, for sure so we take a look here against the Carolina Panthers very good defense I don't know if the initial look was there for Carson with Nelson but I like the how they were able to stick with the play and Nelson was able to find an open window here in the zone right you can see here on third and five we've got three what we call storm routes which are just vertical routes guys working right back down their stem and if we get any kind of shell right with the too high safety look then we can work Ertz really on a man beater there underneath so you can see initially Carson's looking to work the tight end here doesn't like it and as he pulls out he gets underneath and then Nelly just doing a great job here working in concert with Carson he feels his eyes and then he slides around the defender and then again the protection and the ability for Carson to stand tall in the pocket and then to deliver this pass Nelson with the run out the catch it's been real good this year with the run out he really the catch. has been excellent giving us a lot of big plays let's take a look at one of the young guys watch it's been fun watching him develop throughout the season and he's starting to get a few uh, looks here as well in the offense you got Mac Holland's you know, out of North Carolina doing a nice job when he gets his opportunities. He really has done a great job all season long and playing a number of different positions for us in a backup role. And you can see right here, we ended up getting on the line of scrimmage immediately following a big play. Alshon actually ends up at the Z receiver. Ordinarily, he would be lined up where Mac is. So it's a big compliment for Mac to be able to jump in there and, and immediately get to this. And again, off the leverage here, we've got a combination to this side of the field, but then we can work this combination here. And Mac does a great job, again, of being patient, getting his full depth, and leaning this defensive back out. He was already got outside leverage, so Carson knows pre-snap. Hey, look, I got the look. All I got to do is hold the safety back here on the backside hash, and I can rip this ball here to Mac. Good thing about Carson and all these plays, he doesn't have a problem going to any of his receivers. He trusts them all. He does, and they've made plays for him when the balls come to him. Tape Study is brought to you by Chickies and Pete's, proud partner of the Philadelphia Eagles.